Hi guys, so this is three months of trials and tribulations and hair victories. Um, I hope you enjoy. <clears throat> I'm going to start out with the not so hot and the oh no hairstyle. So here we go. These are the not so hot. Even with the sun shades, they're not hot. Oh, these are some twist and brace that I tried on my hair that just didn't work out either. Then like the moisture level. And here are my old nose. Wow. <laughs> the eco styler gel gone wrong with the little flaking and the white mess and it's just a mess. And then here are the wash and goes. That's my first wash and go I did. Michael Jackson jur jury curl thing going on. Then I tried putting tuck combs in it on a different day. Try twisting it back a little bit. That's the back. The size, of course. Hair bands, scarves for hair bands. Some of it was a hit, some of it was a miss. Yeah, it was all just a hit or miss with the wash and goes. I really didn't have any particular favorite wash and goes that I did to my hair. The Eco Styler Gel was definitely something I kept going back to to try to see if I can do the whole Eco Styler Gel in my hair. And the only benefit with the Eco Styler Gel I realized is that it does hold my afro steady. So it gives me a steadier afro when I pick it up, pick it out. This was my last wash and go I did um, this past week. And this is what I did for my interview. Now let's have some fun with scarves. Uh, that was a couple years ago when I first went natural. Now this is back to this year. Rocking the scarves and little beanies and other hair ties. I really liked accessorizing with scarves over the summertime. It was like one of my favorite things to do. Because even if I had a bad hair day, I could just throw a scarf on my hair and it was perfect. And this was like the second day of work. I put a beanie on because I wasn't for sure what to do to my hair. And of course, you always got to have your silk cap, right? At night. All right, my two strand twist. Let's take a journey through these. This was starting out with it. A lot of these I did twist out. I never really wore my hair out outside like this. Sometimes I'm, you know, maybe for a couple of hours or so, but most time it was just so I can do the um, twist out at the end, which that'll be coming up in a few minutes. Yeah, still was having a problem with the moisture control levels in my hair. My mom really liked when I did my hair um, in this particular twist out. And this was like a better one. This is one of the last ones I did. Now here's the two strand twist out it should be. Those are the beginning of the two strand twist outs. And these are the, the ones I just did recently which I've learn if I use flexi rods and you know control my hair porosity and stuff it actually turns out a lot better so I did like the two strand twist out this is the last one I did today I love this perfect all right now braid outs braid outs um I started doing those in the summertime and um that's my first one I plaited my hair or braided it I said plait so it's a plait out for me And um, this is like the second one I did. Look a little hot and sweaty. I remember it was really hot. <laughs> and sometimes with the oils and the butters, it just, you know, had a fill day. I think that was the first day of work, or second day of work or something. But I also like wore my hair in plaits too. And that white shirt I had on. This is when I started getting really better at those braid outs. 
So I, I, I have the twist outs down pat and I had the braid outs down. Still got to get the wash and go a little bit better. My favorite afro. This is back in the day when I, you know, I'm trying to get back to this hair right here. Um, so I have a nice little afro down in Virginia. And this is the last afro I did a couple days ago. This is one of the first afros. <laughs> I kind of blew my hair out there. Not really blew it out, but I twisted it. And then I took it out and then I know my pick. And I was just playing around. I think I that day I actually trimmed my hair with the clippers. I tried to give myself a little tapered afro. It came out okay. Like I said, one of my favorite styles too where it is the afro. Um, I love this one. Yeah, I was just playing around that night before. And this is what I wore to an interview recently. Just a small afro. It came out pretty nicely. I liked it. And now here is me killing it the way I like to wear my hair. It's some of my favorite pictures through the years and recently. Um, now these right here are over the last three months or so. The scarves. I love that purple and white scarf. I, that was the best find. I actually love that dress I had on there. And I really love the way I looked that day. I really like the beanies too. Those really help on those bad hair days. That's back in the day. That's more recently. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.